Hey, what's up, guys? It's Carlos again of the Envy Designs and Influential Gaming. Uh, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create scan lines today. Um, you see it used in you see it used in logos, um, user bars, a lot of places. Um, basically, what you're going to do today is create a new file, and you're going to do three by three pixels. You're going to want to make sure it's a transparent background. All right, create your document. What you're going to do is go ahead and you want to go ahead and use your zoom tool and go into about 3200 so about right there you want to make sure you're 3200 zoom what you can do is you want to get your pencil tool out go over here to your brush tool and click on your pencil you want to make sure your color is black All right. from there you're going to make one dot right here one dot right there one dot right there all right, from there you're gonna go to edit, define pattern, and go ahead and call your pattern scan line. And you've just made a pattern. All right, now if you exit out of this document, you've already created your scan line. Basically, the way you would use your scan line now is if we use start a new document, I'm gonna go ahead and start a default Photoshop size to use an example. Um, let's say I start this background, make a new layer, I'll go ahead and make a white background so you guys can just see it. When you hit on transform properties, or your layer properties, your layer style, you can go hit pattern overlay, click on your pattern, click on your patterns, and you'll see right here, there's your scan lines, and you now have scan lines simple as that not very hard so you can even change it to a darker one turn it back on you notice you have scan lines now you might not be able to see it. I'm not sure if the quality through this video or not but you just created scan lines as easy as that uh, if you guys have any questions or anything or want to see something else done go ahead and leave me a message or just comment rate comment subscribe later guys